Hey everyone. So we have a lot of visualizations that let you look at groupings of hands like a session or a game type and you know, players and all kinds of things. But one thing I wanted to show off is how you can dive into a hand and look at the details about that hand. Um, so you can do that from a lot of different visualizations if they're showing hands. Uh, this one is the hand browser, so it's just a big list of hands in the table. Um, and I'm going to click on one. Uh, and you'll see the detail on the right. Um, one of the cool things about the detail is uh, you get all the information about the hand all at once that you can look at. Additionally, there is a menu when you click the pencil here in the corner. Um, and you get all these different features to help make this hand stand out uh, amongst all the other hands you have. Um, the first thing you can do is star the hand. Um, Clicking that will make a little icon here and over also in the, the table, uh, show as starred. Um, you can turn that back off just by clicking on it again. Um, another fun thing is this is where you add tags to hands. So, uh, you know, you get either you can create a new one, new tag, or you can click on one that you've used before and uh, it'll instantly apply. Um, again, you'll see that over here in the, the table as well. One other thing you can do is write a note about the hand if you wanted to you know, process some thoughts and feelings about the hand. Like, uh, I'm so good at poker. Um, you, know, you, you can save that and uh, you, know, you can access that at any point in time. Another important part of this menu is sharing a hand. When you click it, it will start sharing the hand, which you get with this little blue icon in the toolbar means that it's being shared. You can turn it off right here. You can also send this hand straight to Twitter or Facebook or email it to somebody. And you can even choose to hide, you know, the names of the users in it or, you know, how the hand ended up and, you know, what the, the final result of the hand was. Uh, if you wanted to like spur some discussion about the hand or, or something. So that's pretty fun. You can finally, uh, grab the you know the text for you know two plus two or you know any other forum here so you can copy and paste you know the entire uh, you know layout of the hand right into a uh, forum post one other really cool thing about all this is while you see the entire hand at once in this detail mode you can click this button here in the header in the top right for a replayer mode uh, and what the replayer is, is more like an instant replay of the hand. Um, you can, you have these controls at the bottom, uh, and I'm going to turn off the sound since I'm talking. But you can play through a hand and pause it at any point, and you might not instantly see what the result will be of this hand. Um, so I'm going to start playing one, uh, and you know, it'll just go through. You can, like I said, you can pause. Uh, you can hop through hands over here. Um, and you get a really great HUD right here for every player that shows stats. Um, you can even set those stats by clicking the gear in the corner and picking which you know stats you want to put in the HUD. Finally, you can click up here where you choose between detail and replayer. Um, you can even split, you know, and see both at the same time which is really handy as you're you know, looking through a session or something like that. 